Ready now. And uh, away they go. Ode to the Ocean, Crimson Princess, Tipsy, Tarragon busts through. Then comes Homely Girl at their outside. Emirate Gina not too far away. Queen of Shadows, Pink Sleeves and Yellow Cap. No real pace for now. Queen of Smoke and Emerald Princess are the next two. They are about midfield. The Simple Simple at their outside. Supreme Quest is in the all red. Races alongside Terra Time. And the back marker is in the beginning. Pace a little better now through the 1100. Tipsy, Tarragon in front by two. Over Ode to the Ocean who races away in second. Further two lanes away to Homely Girl who shows up at the outside of Crimson Princess then came Queen of Shadows, Queen of Smokers in the yellow with the purple stars and racing a good eight lengths off the leader then we go a further length away to Simple Simple Emirate Gina, Supreme Quest was next, Emerald Princess got ten lengths to make up, then comes Terra Time and in the beginning races towards the back of the field with 700 metres left to run, Tipsy Tarragon guides them away, she's got herself a little bit more breathing space at the top of the straight she's a three length leader over O to the ocean. Homely girl, red sleeve striped cap. Then comes Crimson Princess in the pink and grey towards the inside. Queen of Smoke, Queen of Shadows, Simple Simple and Supreme Quest. But past the 400, Tipsy Tarragon has a commanding four-length lead. Homely girl. Then comes Ode to the Ocean. Crimson Princess, they were further back. Emerald Princess is next. But Tipsy Tarragon past the 200 is a four-length leader over Homely Girl. Then Crimson Princess towards the inside. But they never saw Tipsy Tarragon with 50 50 metres left to run. She had them on the stretch and Tipsy Tarragon wins. Second goes the way of Crimson Princess. Then came Queen of Shadows and Emerald Princess. Well, they never laid a hoof on Tipsy Tarragon. That is just the way, isn't it? Career earnings now go towards 250,000 rand. Three-time winner from 12 start. She's back to winning ways and she's got a little bit of black type to go to her name as well by winning the 2023 Syringa Handicap. Number six, Tipsy Tarragons come through to win Syringa Handicap listed. What a day it's been for Tony Peter and, of course, to the Full Yuns. And they certainly deserve a good day at the office. Blue Sky Thoroughbreds bred. And uh, this man again, Dennis Shaws. Shaw sure, just went up to the front and not for the catching today. Yes, uh, we, we were trying to give her a little bit of a chance and sort of let her to, uh, get her to settle because she was pulling quite aggressively early on when she got to Tony. And... Uh, she, she really switched off nicely in the last couple of runs and so today I decided to also get her up there. I would have loved to be in front like I was and uh, thank, thankfully it worked out. The other horses with a bit of pace never came to challenge me and she loved every step of it and uh, yeah, well done to Tony, nice little feature in the bag and uh, well done to Auntie Suzette and Mombasi for the, thank you to them for the opportunity as well and a lovely day to them. Very good day for you too, congratulations. Thank you so much. Thank you, Dennis. Here he is, the man of the moment, Tony Peter. Strike rate phenomenal, and uh, here's another one. Well done. Yeah, this is a lovely filly, but a nightmare to train. She's so difficult, whereas Scallywag earlier on is a pleasure to train. She just does everything wrong in the wrong way, so it's taken a bit of time to work her out and get used to her. A uh, big thank you to her work rider, Janus. He's the only guy that can work her. She runs away with everybody else, so just a big thanks and well done to Janus. Uncle Basi and Auntie Zeta, Suzette again, no one deserves it more than them. And I'm just so happy that I could um, uh, have this opportunity to give them a double on the day. They've had a treble, so I'm sure they're ecstatic. And uh, Bruce Leroux at Blue Sky Thoroughbreds, he bred this filly. I'm sure he'll be happy. There's black type on her now, mm. and that was the aim. So, yeah, I think everyone's all happy. Now you said that in the earlier interview, you said just trying to get some black top and here we go. Yeah, just a big uh, thanks and well done to Sam, her groom. She's really not easy and he just relaxes her and uh, reassures her. So just a big thanks and well done to him. Well done to you, Tony. And then Dennis, I thought that was a brilliant ride. Um, we've been working on settling her. Uh, she just takes a bit and she runs away. But today he managed to bring her back to him and uh, it paid off at the end. 
Please will you accept the trophy on behalf of the Fulluns. Here it is, the Syringa listed trophy, a lovely trophy, and they've got a fantastic one to take home as well. Tony, one more question. Do you, are you going to keep it or are you going to send it to her? How does it work with her? No, I'm sending it for her. I've already told her to get a spot ready on the shelf at the farm, so they, they're extremely excited. Wonderful. Thank you, Tony. Thank you. Well done. Now, there's the uh, take-home trophy, and that'll be sent to uh, Yusuf Zet and Barsi. Now, we've got Jomo coming in to represent Sam, who is the groom, World Sports Betting, not to forget the groom, of course. Uh, Jomo, well done. Uh, Sam, the groom of this. Uh, quite a difficult uh, filly, is she? She is a bit of this. And then we did it better to win the race if uh, but did it keep on, keep on, did it get her right now? She know what she's doing, and I must, almost, I must say, thank you, Mrs. Splatoon and Mr. Mr. Bassi. They are sponsors. They look after us well, well, well. They are good persons, too. They certainly are, and well done to you and the whole team, Jama. Thank you. Thank you, thank you Jama. Here we go. Here's the uh, trophy for the groom, and that will be Sam that gets the trophy. He looks after Tipsy Tarragon. Thank you, Jama. And there's the check, one and a half thousand rand. Compliments of World Sports Betting. Thank you, Jama. Six, nine, eight, and five. That's the result. Syringa handicap this afternoon. Suzette and Barsi, your trophy is in the post. One more to go out here. Turfentine is getting a bit chilly out here and a little bit windy as well for, uh, for Joburg. I'll get you back to the studio.